Hi, it's Avisha, your DFW real estate agent and Frisco resident. I'm here today to tell you a little bit about Frisco and what to expect when moving here. So we'll talk about entertainment districts, um, schools, I'll give you some statistics, and we'll also talk about future developments. Before we get started, I'd really appreciate a like and subscribe from anyone here who's watching this video. As you can see on this map, uh, Frisco is located 25 miles north of downtown Dallas. Um, it's easily accessible via State Highway 121 and Dallas North Tollway. Um, Frisk, this does make Frisco a popular choice for commuters who are wanting to also work in the city but live in a suburban community. Frisco will continue to experience um, residential growth. There's new housing developments like single-family homes and multifamily complexes that are um, continuously being built all around. Uh, Obviously, due to this, commercial and retail are also um, coming about, and the legacy Western Plano, which is just a 10-minute drive in Frisco, has become a major business and entertainment district, which has been attracting corporate um, offices, restaurants, and high-end retail establishments. So due to the continual growth, there are ongoing and planned infrastructure projects like road expansions and public transportation improvements. So another major uh, future development that's going to be here in Frisco uh, will be the Universal Studios for kids um, age 3 through 9 years old and that will be located just east of Dallas North Tollway on a huge 97 acres. Frisco ISD is one of the fastest growing school districts in Texas and the United States. Um, they continually receive high ratings on its educational excellence. Um, and this is because of the innovative way of teaching and the various extracurricular programs such as sports, fine arts, and robotics. Um, the district places a strong emphasis on college and career readiness, and a significant percentage of its graduates go on and attend prestigious colleges and universities. Um, the school rankings, of course, vary year to year but it is common to find FISD schools ranked highly in various national and state lists of top school districts and best places to live for families. So I'm gonna just throw out some real estate stats on Frisco so you can better understand the city and kind of what's going on in the area. Um, as of quarter one, 2023, the average monthly mortgage payment was um, $2,515 and the medium home price was approximately six hundred dollars And we do see this trending upwards at about 1.3% year over year. Uh, the median days on market for a listed home is 36 and in August 2023, homes in Frisco sold for 2.2% less than asking price on average. There are 12 major neighborhoods in Frisco. Um, one of the PGA neighborhoods are going to be the most expensive, which is up to um, between one and four million dollar houses. Uh, Frisco Lakes is going to be your most affordable neighborhood with a median listing home price of 530k. So now looking ahead, Frisco is projected to continue growing. According to the U.S. Census Bureau, uh, Frisco's population grew by 70% from 2010 to 2020, and that, of course, makes it one of the fastest growing cities in the country. Um, the growth rate indicates continued growth and demand for housing in the area, which in turn obviously means commercial growth as well as creating a favorable market for anyone who's wanting to move here. Now, onto my favorite part which is the shopping and entertainment districts. So the Star is one of them, and it's a sports entertainment uh, complex that's located in the city. It's the official headquarters of the Dallas Cowboys. This complex includes Dallas Cowboys World Headquarters and the Ford Center, which is an indoor stadium that hosts um, multiple events a year. There's also an Omni Frisco Hotel, um, with lots of retail, dining, and also there's a Cowboys Fit, which is a world-class fitness center offering programs for fitness enthusiasts. PGA Fresco is a premier destination for golf enthusiasts, the headquarters of PGA of America. Um, it has state-of-the-art facilities, admin offices, training facilities, and meeting spaces. There's Golf Performance Center that offers instruction, club fitting, and golf technology to help players improve their game. 
The complex also has retail and dining options for visitors to enjoy. A cool thing about Frisco is that there are now two HEBs. For those of you who don't know what HEB is, this is a Texas chain grocery store that offers fresh produce, meat, seafood, bakery items, um, deli foods, household goods, health and beauty items, and pharmacy and floral departments. HEB finally came to Frisco six months ago and we are all here for it. HEB is known for its private label brands, which includes high quality products at competitive prices. They also have locally sourced honey and tortillas made daily, and it is the go-to grocery store when you're a Frisco resident. As I mentioned earlier in the video, um, Legacy West is in Plano, which is just a short 10 minute drive from Frisco. It offers shopping and dining options, and from sushi to makeup to suits, you can literally find it all. Um, there are designer brands like Golden Goose, Louis Vuitton, and Gucci, so if you're the type to shop to your drop, this is the place to be. The cool thing about Legacy is that you can literally live right above all of this and have easy access to all the amazing food and shops. Frisco Square offers a blend of residential, commercial, and entertainment spaces. The development hosts uh, community events and festivals throughout the year, which really brings in a strong sense of community engagement. It's a vibrant, walkable urban center within the city. Um, a cool thing about this is that FC Dallas Soccer Stadium is right across the road, which makes this an even more um, favorable location to be. If Frisco, Texas is an option for you, um, let me know. I've put my contact information down below in the description. Um, I also don't just work Frisco, I work all of DFW and all price points.